Thank you, Bo. Oh, I'm I'm silly. You can stay. <laughs> hey, Bo! Hey guys, how are we all doing? Hope everyone is doing okay. Just um, a little chat whilst I put on makeup. First things first, I will be using um, a foundation primer. Radiance Bronze is the name by Laura Mercier. And I'm just gonna put a little bit of this on to a flat brush. Um, and just apply a little bit around. I can't tell you how much I love it. it. Gives me a nice shimmer. Even before I begin my foundation, I love it, love it, love it. I use NARS Sheer Glow Foundation. What's the name? It just says dark, medium. So that's what I use. I always like to go down onto my neck with my foundation. The last thing you want is a dark face and a powder neck that is not the one it's such a bad habit whether i'm driving where i'm putting makeup on whether i'm eating you'll find me to my to my left side yeah to my left side it's so weird so i've just got to remember to keep sitting up so bad yep i bring that all the way down all right so now that's all in doubt move on to the concealer concealer I talk weird, by the way. Everything's got a nickname, or everything has got to be sung. I blame Hubby for all that. I was already weird, obviously, but he's made me even more weird. I don't know why I'm trying to make this all cute. I just start dabbing it down um, with a beauty sponge. How have I not told you what concealer it is? It's by Too Faced, born this way. Multi-use sculpting concealer. That's what I'm using under my eyes, guys. It's really, really, really thick, which is exactly what I need under these bad boys. It's called light beige. Light beige. Light beige. I don't know how many shades you need to go down from your skin tone, but I do like to go slightly lighter just so my eyes brighten up. It just makes me look less tired. And gosh, the difference. And then I'm just going to dab the other eye, obviously. And I always go right into the corner because these parts are really dark for me as well. Um, I do like to dab my finger just to make sure it's all in nicely. There's so many different ways of putting on makeup. Some people start their eyes first, their eyes last, foundation first, foundation last. I don't think there's any rules. I just think as long as you apply your makeup and you're happy with it and you're having fun, who cares, really? and we can make ourselves look half decent and half human, then why not? So again, another Laura Mercier product. Um, this is a loose setting powder, translucent. I really love this product. This goes on really nice, it does the job. Just sets everything really lovely and drop blue. So I'm just gonna apply a little bit of that under my eye, just so it sets what we've done. Like so. That's my look finished. What do you think, guys? Joke, 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 joke. Brush it away, just lightly. There you go. I've got like this OCD thing where my lips go dry. I just feel like I'm just gonna be thinking about that all the time. So I'm just gonna plug a bit of this on. Mm, lovely. Right. We are now gonna move on to an eyebrow pro in the black brown color. Our friend Neelam, she has um, this out guys, so make sure you check out all her bits, so many products in here that are just base for the eyebrows. Eyebrow queen, make sure you go on Instagram, buy yourselves one of these. What's amazing about this product is that one end is the brush and one end is a nice, it's really fine and really thin, it just really helps you sculpt around your eyebrows. I'm gonna brush these up. And it's so much, it's, it's so fine that it, it just works. I don't want to spend too much time on my eyebrows because they look bad anyway. And I think if I just keep adding products to them, it will just look messier. So I'm just going to fill it in a little bit just so it looks a bit more full and less patchy. What I like about this is that you can literally fill them in and brush them through at the same time as you're going along, which is really, really handy. 
Okay, like I said, I can sit here and play with my eyebrows all day, so I'm going to stop. I'm going to try a new palette that I've never used before, but I nude. And it's new and it's delicious and it's fabulous, so. Look how delicious that is. It's brand new and it's just gorgeous and it's just beautiful and just. I think I'm gonna go for something called Teddy, right in the corner. It just looks lovely. I've never used this palette before, so I just hope this goes on. The way I want it to. I'm gonna stick to just one colour today. Just gonna pat that down um, and lift it up a little bit and just make sure I've got enough product on the lid of my eye. Really, 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 really like this colour. Never used it before. I thought I'd share it with you. Share it with you. Share it with you. I'm just gonna lift the product all the way up to the brow. I'm using a bit of teddy, which is the same colour on top of my eyes. I'm going to put it underneath um, my eye, so it's the same colour, just like a little eyeshadow. I'm going to be using Bad Girl from Benefit. It is my mascara. I love it, love it, love it. I like my lashes to be like out there. I'm going to use MAC um, Dark Deep. This is really dark. I know it's too dark for me, but um, that's what I'm going to use today. Um, my brush is iconic, it's nice and bloody, bloody. Dolls Highlighter Palette. So I'm going to try one of these and see what I think. It's perfect if you don't want a strong highlighter on. So I like to bring it down to my nose and down to my I'm going to use a lip liner from MAC. Um, it is called Spice, it's my go-to, I always use it. I'm now going to apply um, a lip gloss that I absolutely love. It's from Fenty Beauty and this one is called, just as Fenty Glow. I think it's probably the original. Fitch. I don't know if you can hear that, I have a Simon singing again. Literally, live for this. Live for this colour. So. Oh, are you filming? <laughs> I am filming. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry, sorry. It's sorry. all right. I'm at the end of my look. Oh, my apologies. Thank you, Bo. Oh, my camera. I'm silly. You can stay. Hey, wait! It's all like anyway I'm just gonna finish the look with a bit of setting mist um, I'm just gonna spray like so mm -mm -mm. oh my god this smells so good so good um yeah god it smells really good it's beautiful lovely Another thing that smells really good actually, which has nothing to do with makeup, is my hairspray. This hairspray just gets down all the fluffy flyaways and it is the only brand I use for my hair, the Moroccan oil hairspray. So I'll do another look on what I do with my hair, what products I use, but it's always these products, love them. I hope you've really enjoyed the step-by-step um, -step makeup, not tutorial. Um, a mini tiny glam just um, around the house during the quarantine. Um, if you liked what you saw and you enjoyed me applying the makeup, then comment below, subscribe. Um, <laughs> you're right in there, babe. <laughs> 
Uh, comment below, subscribe, um, leave me another comment to let me know if you enjoyed the video and if you um, want to see anything else, if you want to do, if you, if you want to do, if you want me to do another makeup tutorial or fashion or cooking, just let me know what you guys want. Um, let's do this together. Let's create memories and videos together. Um, and yeah, it's just nice to sit and have a chit chat about life and makeup and stuff. So yeah, hope you really enjoyed guys and I'll speak to you guys soon. Lots of love, bye.